Uh, once again, welcome back to Uganda Technology and Management University. And with you is Dorothy Wegoe Chimoli, the Principal Marketing and Public Relations Officer of the Mighty University. With me here today is Mr. Mejan Turiahewa. He is the Dean of the School of Education, Technical and Vocational Education at the university. And he's going to share with us what it is like being a dean at the school and what our expectations will be when we all join this mighty institution. And uh, Mr. Turia Hewa, can you briefly tell us who you are? All right, uh, thank you very much, uh, Dorothy. Uh, like we have already uh, talked about uh, my profile, uh, Maja Turia Hewa is my name. And uh, possibly to add on what you have not said is that I'm a professional teacher. So uh, I'm here to share with you uh, what you can benefit from Uganda Technology and Management University. At the same time, what you can benefit from uh, my, uh, the school that I had. Okay. Uh, knowing about your school, which is talking about uh, education, is talking about technical and vocational. Can you tell us what is involved in uh, technical education and what is involved in vocational? Uh, all right, uh, thank you very much, uh, Dorothy. Uh, I will begin by saying that, uh, yes, uh, when you come to Uganda Technology and Management University, you are going to be educated in various areas. Now, uh, to be technical means that you need to get some technical skills that enable you to have hands-on activities. Uh, for instance, if you run uh, mobile phone applications development, that is uh, a technical uh, skill that you get. Uh, when you learn uh, computer repair, then you are learning uh, a technical skill. At the same time, you can also learn a vocational skill and this means that you are able to get uh, knowledge and skills that can enable you to go and even begin your own uh, projects and businesses and here we train you to uh, become innovators both in the line of business and in the line of computing. Now on the other hand we also uh, give you skills and uh, knowledge of leadership and management. So you are able to, for instance, begin your own business and manage your own business, and that is what you should expect when you come at Utam. Now again, uh, in the School of uh, Education, uh, Technical and Vocational Education, we have professional courses that can enable you to get international qualifications. Uh, for instance, we have the International Driving License, ICDL, International Computer Driving License, ICDL, uh, which is an international organized course that you can do at Utamu. We have CCNA, and then we have Project Planning and Management. Uh, you can get all these trainings at Utamu. It's such a rich school, but uh, having mentioned all those uh, opportunities that students can find at, uh, at your school, which are those programs that you feel if students come to the School of Education, Technical and Vocational Education, they will go away and become so significant in the job market? Uh, all right, uh, thank you very much, uh, Doris, uh, the Principal Marketing and Public Relations Officer. Uh, possibly what I had forgotten to mention earlier on uh, is that uh, we have a UBTEP center. Now, UBTEP stands for Uganda Business and Technical Examination Board. Now, they have given us a right to train students and then they can be able to examine them at the end of the training and they will be able to obtain qualifications that <coughs> are internationally organized. Uh, you can do courses, diplomas and certificates uh, in procurement and surprise management. Uh, in business management, in uh, project planning and management that are examined by UBTEP. 
Now, the other important thing that I want to mention here is that in all our organizations, we use computers. And you need a training on how to use computers for, for performing different functions. So, uh, in the school uh, of education, technical and vocational education, this is what we help you to, to do, to gain skills on how to use different computer applications at different levels. So you can gain these skills uh, and you can have hands-on training. Now again, most important, uh, you all know that in this modern uh, era, uh, we have issues of computer and information security. Now this is very critical. We ensure that our students that we train, we give them this knowledge of how do you ensure that you manage information security very well. Again, I cannot overemphasize the, the need for training in social media marketing. Social media uh, activities are very common these days. Uh, even e-commerce is very common. So our students are equipped with the skills of digital marketing. They are equipped with the skills of managing social media. They are equipped with the skills of entrepreneurship management, entrepreneurship and business development. So we emphasize all these skills uh, in, in the school. Then, again, another important thing is data analysis. That you have heard about big data, you have heard about artificial intelligence and machine learning. These are skills that we equip with our students at Utamu. And uh, you can do these short courses within a period of five weeks or less. And then you, gain, you get your, your qualifications, but at the same time, you get the skills and this will make you competitive in the market. And you can even come up with your own innovations and actually become an entrepreneur at the end if that is your area of interest. Because we have experts who will train you very, very well. Uh, many of them are industry practitioners. And at the end of it all, you come out when you, you are wholly developed as an individual. What I would want to add on, Dorothy, is that uh, when you come at Uganda Technology and Management University, you, you should expect to have a brand of skills and knowledge. Because as you can hear from the name, uh, business and technology are branded to bring out a holistic person. So you, you get the skills in technology and, and then you get the skills in management science. So you end up becoming uh, a very good leader when you get out uh, to the field. You, 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 if you, you went and interviewed the students who have gone through term, or you interview their supervisors, they will tell you that this is a, a different brain of people and, and they, have, they, they are thanking us uh, almost every day for having trained these students so well. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, Utama has a lot to offer to every student that has every intention of coming to study. It is the place to be if you want to grow, if you want to diversify, and if you want to be purposeful. We are listening from the voice of the School of Education, Technical and Vocational Education. There are so many other schools that we have at this university. But before we conclude, I just want uh, Mr. Triaheba to tell us what defines Otamu from other universities that would make our students competitive in the job market. All right, uh, thank you very much, Dorothy, once again. I want to say that uh, there is a uniqueness uh, that I have seen for the last uh, uh, eight years I've been at Uganda Project Management University. Uh, and this uh, one uniqueness is the student-centered approach of training students. Uh, this is a unique approach uh, which cannot easily be imitated by many institutions. Now, the student-centered approach means that we aid the students to be able to learn and to explore. Now, when you use this approach, the student-centered approach, the students comes out when they are confident because they have developed their, 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 their technologies by, by, by putting in a lot of effort. 
So they, they, have, they have learned a lot of skills, but they have also been involved in that learning. Not just by pumping knowledge into them, but by engaging them. Now when you add this to our community engagement approach, that uh, by the time our students leave uh, our term as a student, especially those who are on, uh, three years or four years, they, they have gained a lot of practical experiences through the community engagement that we emphasize. That uh, this community engagement that we conduct at Utamu enables the students to get the feel of the workplace for, for more than nine months. And this is unique in its way. So by the time a student leaves uh, Utamu, uh, they, 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 are, they, are, they are different, and that's what makes them competitive when they go out into the labor market. Mm -hmm. And many of them actually even initiate their own businesses because they have developed the, the, the knowledge and skills that they need to be able to manage their own mm -hmm. uh, enterprises. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, before I forget, uh, we are living in busy times where people must go to work. Basically, they must balance their work and their academics. So most of the people worry about the duration of programs. What is the duration of the programs in your school? Okay, like I talked about it earlier on, that uh, most of the short courses that we manage in the school of education, technical and vocational education, uh, take a period of uh, five weeks. There are professional courses that take about one month. But again, uh, that one also helps me to mention that we, we have customized executive training which can be tailored to the needs of the client, uh, especially for big organizations. And therefore, we can schedule the training according to your, to your, to your own schedules that you, you, you are comfortable with. And therefore, uh, if, you are preferable, if you are preferring weekends, we can organize during the weekends. If you want it in only one week uh, marathon, we can also organize it to be organized that way. So in, in other words, uh, when we go in for the customized uh, training, then it, 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 it answers your question of the issue of, of the time. Again, another important thing is that uh, Utam has mastered the use of e-learning uh, and e-technologies. And here, it means that you can shape your learning to be able to learn even when you missed the face-to-face. The, the -face. You can shape to learn at your own pace uh, through the e-learning technology.